So you want to just talk about the FX2 a little bit first? Yeah. Um, to sum it up, what, what's, uh, what, what would you, in one word, what would you sum it up? So if, if you haven't watched all this stuff, if you're watching mm-hmm. this right now, you probably already been consuming content, but basically mm-hmm. it's, they took an FX3 body, mm-hmm. a few changes we'll talk about. Mm-hmm. They put the A7 IV guts inside. Mm-hmm. So we're talking 33 megapixel, 7K sensor. Uh, from what I could see, it's like all the same video specs, pretty much. We're gonna get oversampled 4K up to 30 frames per second, cropped 4K 60. And raw video. Well, th- what That's a, the difference. So, well, big difference is raw, but what, what, what did you notice about the raw? It's cropped. It's, a, it's cropped raw video, which is, uh, it's, it's almost like, uh, it's 4.7K, so it's not 4K. You got higher resolution than the FX3, but the, the FX30 has 4.7K. So it's almost doing what the FX30 does, but on that full frame sensor. So you're getting Super 35 in 4.7K. You're getting raw. You're probably going to get the whole uh, B raw update later on this year, even though I didn't see anyone mention that. I didn't see that I- I'm assuming, like, there's no reason they're going to do it to the FX3 and the FX30 and not do it to this FX2. Yeah. 